the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, we're going to help this new reach second C using the gum fruit. But before that, I created a Twitter account for this channel. Please do follow for future announcements and giveaways. Okay, let's start. So first things first, let's eat this fruit. Gamer Nom, what are your thoughts? For me, gum fruit is one of the best fruits for grinding. But why Gamer Nom? Look at the skills. The mastery needed to unlock them is kinda low, which means unlocking skills will be faster. Okay, so guys, let me show it to you. So first, we have the pistol skill, right? So we're gonna start with the bandits. Again, lure them. Guys, check this out. For your first skill, the pistol skill, it's a multi-target skill as long as you aim properly. There you go, which means leveling up here will be faster. So the goal in this island is to reach level 10. Again, guys, level 10. And after that, you can now proceed to your next island. And that island is the jungle. Let's go get a boat or a dinghy. Don't forget to save. There you go. And then, off to your next quest. For your first quest here, you need to defeat six monkeys. So lure three, right? At the time, there you go. You can just lure them in the waters and just use your pistol to damage them. And everything will be fine. Okay, the goal here is to reach level 15. And after that, you can start with the gorillas. Again, guess 15. They're located here. Again, you just need to lure four. Use your pistol to defeat them. There you go. Big. Okay. You will reach level 20 after just one quest. And after that, you can start defeating the Gorilla King. So guys, it's easy to defeat again. High ground is our friend here. Just use your Z skill. Z skill. Z skill. Guys, goal here is to reach level 30. And by the time we will be unlocking our second skill, guys, the cannon. Don't worry, I'm gonna show it to you. I go I just master it when. So again, we will be having two skills to damage enemies. Check that out, guys. Almost half HP for the gorilla. So again, level up will be faster. When you reach level 30, we can now proceed to our next island. And that island is a pirate village. Okay, guys, no more dinghy. This loop is the new meta. Arriving pirate village. Here we go. Don't forget to save So for our first quest, we are gonna defeat the pirates okay, Clown pirates. Oh, just pirates. Sorry. Okay, here we go. You need to lure four and There you go. Use your skills pistol and cannon guys take note of this level 30 You can defeat this pirates with just two sets of your skills, which is really fast comparing it to the other fruits go again the goal here is to reach level 40 before we move on stat check 20 melee defense blast fruit 56 okay for our next mob guys again let's reach 40 first there you go for our next mob we have the brutes so those brutes you need to defeat 10 of them they're located here one two three four and five Use your skills. It's kind of hard here because you will knock them back using your cannon, but just be patient. Again, that's our strongest weapon, being patient. There you go. Yes, the goal here is to reach level 60, but at level 55, you can start defeating Bobby, yeah, the mini boss in this island. Bobby the Clown, or in One Piece, Buggy. Okay, there you go. Let's just be aware, you might get hit by the Sword Slash, that one. Just make sure to dodge it and use your skills, okay? Again, go here is to reach level 60. And when you reach that, you are ready to move on to your next island. Guys, I think there's a chance that they will upgrade this fruit, like the gear 4th, if you're watching One Piece. I hope they do that. Oh, for our next island, we have the desert. Make sure to save every time you reach a new island. We're gonna start here with the desert bandits. So again, 8 guys, just lure 4. Same with the pirates. Use your skills, there you go. Easy to be honest. Goal here is to reach level 75, but before that, we will be unlocking a new skill. Just three skills, guys, in just three islands. There you go, the rush. I'm gonna show it to you. There you go. Damage is really good as long as you hit it properly, okay? So, guys, goal 75, right? And after that, we can now proceed to our next target mob. Go the desert officers. 
So let's head there. There we go. You can lure four at a time, but you just need to defeat six. So three is enough. Do it twice to level up. Guys, the goal here is to level 105. You can leave this area at 90, but guys, I suggest just reach 105. And also, we will be taking a different approach in leveling up this character since the damage is really high, to be honest, in the early stages. So we're gonna take advantage of that. For our next island, we got the Frozen Village. Before grinding, make sure to go to the cave and buy every skill that the Ability Teacher sells. We got the Geppo, the Buso, and the Soru. The Geppo is the Sky Jump. Guys, here, we're gonna start with the Yeti, right? And we're gonna end with the Yeti. We're gonna do this. We're gonna server hop, guys. So, but if you want, you can go with the Sky Baddest. But for this account, we're just gonna do server hop all the time. If you have a chance. We're gonna compare the levels later. The experience. You guys, go here is reach level 130. We're just gonna defeat this one. The Yeti. I expect leveling to be faster. More candies, etc. There you go. Just the Yeti. Do server hop. If you want, you can go with Snow Bandits. Okay, next island, guys, we will go to the Marine Fortress. Right, Marine Fortress. Same with the Yeti, guys. 130, we're gonna start here with the Vice Admiral. Check the experience. 350,000, right? So how do you defeat him? It's very easy, guys. You have three skills, which will damage him high enough. Oops. Okay. Check this out. See skill? Access skill. Okay. Goal here, guys, is to reach level 225. Yeah, that's the first time that I'm gonna do this. Why? I'm gonna compare to you. At 150, you can go the Sky Island, right? Check the experience, guys. 250,000. Dark Master, 350,000. So, I suggest you stay here with the Vice Admiral, 350,000. But, but the disadvantage of this is you will keep on leaving the game, etc. Right? So at 225, we will unlock our final skill, the second transformation. So it will just make the damage higher. So here it is, Coliseum, guys. So we're gonna start here with the Toga Warriors. You need to defeat seven. You can lure four at a time. Guys, if you activated your uh, second transformation, the damage will be higher. Check that out. Just why the rush? More than half HP. So again, leveling up will be a lot faster. Gamer, how about the Haki? Will it increase the damage? No. I checked it, so if I'm doing something wrong, just comment it in the comment section. So next up, at 275, the Gladiators. So just lure 4. There you go, 1, 2, 3, and 4, and use your same strategy. Use your Rush, Cannon, Pistol, Rush, Cannon, Pistol. Make sure that your second transformation is activated. By the way, uh, there's... Oh, so I <laughs> died, guys. I died. So no one's perfect. Well, let's go back. Yes, you can defeat this with just one combo, I guess. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. One combo plus one pistol. Anyways, guys, there's an area here. They call it the prison. So you can level up here. You can defeat three bosses. The Warden, Chief Warden, the Swan. Guys, you can... I don't suggest uh, doing boss kills here because... There's no save point here. From what I know, guys, if I'm wrong, it's fine. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm sorry, but if there's no save point here and you do server hop and someone already killed it, lots of time will be wasted. Well, anyways, at level 300, Magma Village is our target island. We're gonna start here with the military soldiers. You need to defeat 9, so we can lure 5 at a time. They're all 5. In this bridge. Yeah, the bridge. There you go. Defeat them. And everything will be fine. You're gonna need to do this twice to level up. Goal here is to reach level 330. And after that, we're gonna proceed to our next target, the military spies. Again, you need to defeat 8. Same strategy. Lure 4. Use your skills. But guys, this mobs use Soru. So make sure to like dodge fast. See that? He almost died again. Goal here is to reach level 375, but at 350, you can start defeating this one. Akainu, Magma Village, or sorry, Magma Admiral Boss. It's easy to defeat, don't worry. Just dodge the skills. Next up, Underwater Cave. Here you go. We're gonna start with the Fishman Warriors and we're gonna end with them. Just lure four at a time with your newfound power, the second transformation. Defeating them will be a lot easier. There you go. You need to defeat 8, right? 
The goal here is to reach level 450 and at level 425 we can start defeating the Fishman Lord. So guys, use your skill, right? Make sure to dodge after that. You need to dodge the trident. Yeah. The damage of that is kind of decent, so make sure to dodge it. Dodge, dodge. Oh, I wasn't able to dodge. I almost died, so don't worry. We're gonna defeat him. Again, 450 is the goal here. Next up, guys, we are moving or going to the Skylands. There you go. First time we see this, we skip the quest, right? Remember? Here in the Skylands, we're gonna go step higher. There it is, and we're gonna start grinding the God's Guards. So you need to lure four at a time because you need to defeat seven, right? Four and three, that's fine. There you go. They're easy to defeat. One combo is enough, which will make your grinding faster. You guys at level 500, you can start defeating the Whisper, do server hop if you really want. But my goal here is to reach level 525. Here it is, the Whisper. I'm just gonna show you. Dodge that cannon, everything will be fine. Easy, right? Skill, dodge. Skill, dodge. You can do two skills sometimes. There you go. It's up to you to gauge the skills, okay? So we're gonna skip the Shanda quest. We're gonna go straight to the Royal Squads. You need to defeat eight, right? So lure four. Five if you want. Me, I always lure five. <laughs> For more experience. There you go. I'm really amazed of how strong the rush is. As long as you hit them, grinding will be a lot faster. So goal here is to reach level 575 and after that, defeat Thunder God until you reach level 625. Which means we're gonna do server hopping again. Again, the only hard thing there is you need to like reset the game, right? Reset, enter a server, make sure that there is the boss, and the spawn point is near. Okay, that's those are the requirements. Next stop, guys, final island. We have the Fountain City. Here we're gonna defeat the galley pirates. You can lure four at a time, lure them in the middle, defeat them using your skills, obviously. You need to defeat 8 to finish 1 quest. You guys at 675, you can start defeating the mini boss here, the cyborg. No worry, I'm gonna show it to you. You can do server hop, okay? Starting from that point, there you go, cyborg. So you guys here, you just need to like dodge the cannon skill because the damage of the skill is kinda high. That one. We did not receive the full damage. Okay, so guys, you can do server hop starting level 675 if you really want to make things faster and as well as if you want the drop of this boss. There you go, guys. At 700, you will unlock a quest. Okay, go to the prison, find the detective. Okay, he is located here. There you go. He will ask you to then go to the frozen village, go to the cave, use the key that he will give you to open the door and defeat the ice admiral. We will tell you something, never mind. <laughs> to make things faster, go back to the detective. And after that, you can now go to the middle town. So I know you are aware of this town. Okay, and then talk to the experienced captain. Okay, and this captain will then send you to the second sea. And our goal in this video is done. So guys, what do you think? For me, I really love this fruit. I hope that they upgrade this. Next fruit, I think, the door fruit or max level dragon. Comment it in the comment section. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNom, and GamerNom out.